Hello everyone, how's everyone doing? Hope everyone's doing well. Tonight we got the Sofern SF05. Um, honestly, you guys, I was going to pass on this review, but uh, I just really thought about it and uh, it is a new release and, you know, I want to, if you guys are, any of you guys are in the market, you'll know what you're getting. These do come in uh, white, red, and green. I got the white version and I'm... You know, this channel, I don't bash on lights. I, it's not what I do, you know. Um, I, I like all lights, but if it's a terrible light, it's a terrible light. Um, so I'm not going to bash on this all the way because it does come in red and green, and that could um, be the, the winning point of this light. I will say it's definitely uh, well-built, real good quality, and it's cheap. Uh, right now it's on sale for like 15 bucks. I'll show you guys the stats real quick. Uh, let's see. So yeah, you can get it for 15 right now. I paid 17.99 for mine without the battery. But uh, let me see. So you got the white light, the green light, and the red light. And, uh, uh, let's see, what else? Uh, so the LED in it's an XML T6, and then the red LED is a X, XPG2 R3, and the green LED is XPG2 G4. And they're 10, wa 10 watts, and brightness is 560 to, 560 to 1,000 lumens. I think the white LED is supposed to be 1,000 lumens, and this is not even close. I'll show you guys that here in a sec. Um, that's about it. They don't even got a... Uh, no like the modes so it's really I think it only has a few modes but um this is a zoomy light and like I said it is a uh, built really well I will give them that um, I got it without the battery no instructions and it came with two o-rings and a lanyard I took it lanyard was on it I took it off but yeah let's check this out get this box out of the way so here it is the SF05 that right there I should have had a clue but like I said look there's little but it, you know you always get a little wood it's really solid when it's all the way focused out really solid and the build quality on it like I said the buttons tight everything's good on it it's just I don't like the the lumens and the way it looks and I was kind of afraid of that when I bought this but I took a gamble as new and um what got me liking zoomies you guys is basically these two right here and um I have issues with these because they're underpowered. First of all, with this one, the main issue is it takes three AAAs. I don't like that. It should run on, you know, 18650. Uh, second thing is it only has two modes, low and high. And a third thing is, um, oh, what was the third thing? Um, oh, not enough power just way under power it's only 300 it's a nice this is a real nice beam though that's all the way focused they did this perfect in my opinion um this is all right all uh, i don't know i'd probably say it's halfway there but that's what it needs to be you know just in my opinion and uh this is basically the same thing as this um this is the m12 let me focus it on. I think that is that focused out. 
Oh, there you go. But uh, this is 800, and this is underpowered for its size, but if this had, in this package, this would be hard to beat. And then uh, Sofern, this is Sofern's S11C, and uh, this is, honestly, I like this light. This is, It's just cheap. The only, the things about this light I don't like is it's cheap filling it's just it's just the quality feels cheap and then uh, no tells i want a clicky for my zoom and then it's a twist i don't like the twist I mean, you can hear it squeaking it's but i don't like the twist and look you got screws just cheap but honestly the features on this it has your low medium high moonlight and turbo magnetic tail cap and it's a pretty strong tail cap for being cheesy and um what else is, um just the ui is perfect for a, a zoomy in my opinion you guys but this right here is i i don't want a twisty one i can still do it one-handed but it just takes too long i like the the up and down slide uh, that's what i like this, this light like i said this is something i i never even carried this because it's just not enough it's perfect for up close um inspections and you know looking under the cabinet under the sink around the house but nothing for me you know my i, I can do that with my you know my everyday carry i can inspect things so that's why this this used to be my bedside light i did keep this on my um dresser and right next to me but now i use you know i got my everyday light that i carry not this one but just the everyday light i carry is my bedside light now so this i retired this, this i just put this up but it's still i like this light i just wish it had more modes more power and got rid of them triple a's and uh so back to this one um great everything's good about this just cheap made but needs to be in the reverse and needs up and down and then the, um i'll show you guys the this is 800 lumens, I believe. I think it's supposed to be a thousand, but it is 800 little, almost 900, I think. And you can tell that. But something about this, when you see them at a distance, that's why, honestly, this is a better light than this, just because I could carry this. And I got all the features. I got my moonlight. I can throw it in moonlight right now. That's moonlight. That is so low, you can barely see it. But that's like, so I give this, Def, it, it, wanted, it took a while for me to figure out that this is better than this. and I, But I don't, like I said, I don't like that twist. It needs to go up and down and needs more power. These need to be around 1,800 to uh, 2,000 lumens in my opinion. But what I figured what they've done to make them good is they got a little optic in there. And if you know that all the ones that I like have that optic and i'm not a pro on this you guys or nothing on you know but if you can see right there this is and these are all oh, this is not focused out now but there it is like i said you can tell the sofa is definitely um brighter but something about this tent with this milwaukee it's it's really pleasant and um actually that is turbo okay um now back to this we'll get on this right here i gotta um we're gonna i'm gonna show you what this looks like now like i said i'm not bashing this is really nice everything about it is really made well i don't know if we can see in there Let's see if we can get the moonlight in there Mm -hmm. Nice, the moonlight works. Yeah, if you guys can see in there. So nice um, gold bladed springs in there. I'm going to use a Molly cell. So that's a good cell, P28A. And uh, 
I'm gonna show you what it looks like first and then we'll put it on the meter right here. So that's what I, I, I like that and it's kind of blue. I don't like nothing about this this light right here. This tint, all of that. And then uh You get the dreadful square. Can you guys, is it make picking it up? It looks like a, you know, the old 1980s when you play checkers, the king on checkers, <laughs> or a transformer sign. But yeah, that kind of, yeah, that's terrible. It looks all right. I mean, honestly, I don't like it at all, but take out the square is what I mean right there. But, um, yeah, let's uh, go on the meter real quick, you guys. All right, so you guys can see that. Oh, that glare. Let's see what we get. Uh, Three hundred and fifty with a Molly cell. I think I tried it with Sofern and it was two hundred and something. I never this first time I tried it with the Molly. But yeah, so actually we can go through all the settings just to make sure. So there's one there's one seventy, I think that's medium, low. It goes high, medium, low. Now it's gonna go into the blinkies, I believe. The strobe. Yeah, so that's it. That's your mask. That's crazy. They're way off on that. But, uh, it is a well built light, though. Um, what I was going to say is, I'm going to, when I get to that magic number, you guys, I'm going to reach out to Sofern and see if you guys got any ideas. I got an idea for a perfect, um, zoomy. Like, I mean, this is almost there, you guys. I'm be honest with you. Um, but I got some ideas to make this just outstanding. Um, here's another. This is a Nikron. This is a, this is kind of terrible too. It's it's better than a, It's definitely better than this. And uh, I'm I'm not. I just like the body style and the way this is so slick. Right. I think this is the best body style of all these. And I got this Nebo. Um, what I like about this is that magnetic. This is what I would add on to this. Or right, with this body style, you know, magnetic ring and put the, the button right in the um, center. You know. And um, Basically, I got some ideas to make it better, but I know it's if if anybody knows about you know this um, I guess it'd be a not some type of optic lens, you know, make that better for the flood part because they did it they they did good on the long distance in my opinion, but when you get it up close to the the flood, I think it. It goes, uh, it could be better. You gotta, you know, somebody knows how to, the option of tweaking that. But yeah, when I get to that magic number, I'm gonna reach out to Sofer. And so I definitely, if you guys have any um, suggestions on how to make a better zoomy, and like I said, you know, I try to explain this is basically the best one. I got the best features, magnetic tail cap, just missing the trigger. And I would, the tent, I don't know if it's just this tent. Uh, I don't know what, the, but I've changed uh, whatever Milwaukee did with this tent. They just need to add more power to this thing, man. Um, but yeah, maybe change the tent. And uh, this would be, I, I'd carry it, I swear, because you don't realize how um, valuable, in my opinion, you know, just a zoom to a, a throw. But um, 
yeah, if you guys got any ideas to make one better, um, I'm going to reach out to Sofern and see if I can talk to a representative about it. And if you guys have any ideas, like I said, I'll bring you along in the conversation with them and give them our idea. And I'm serious because I'm tired of buying these Zoomies and I'm not happy with them, just wasting money. Um, I, and also, too, uh, maybe later on as my channel gets um, a little more growth, well, which gives me time, um, I'm going to start switching out um, LEDs, get all the right tools, give me time to get the tools I need. I'm sure I got most of them, but I'm sure there's a few things I need. But yeah, that's a Sofern SF05, you guys. Like I said, um, it's a... Uh, you guys seen what it does. If there's something you need, it might be better in the red and green, but it's definitely not <laughs> not impressive in the white one, at least. But um, yeah, I got some uh, plans to talk to Sofern about this and see if we can get us uh, get our name on a, um, a Zoomy started off like that. If not, you know, try try again. Keep trying until something comes through. But on that one, you guys. I appreciate you for tuning in. God bless. And I'll see you on the next one.